Hello! In this video I'll be showing you how to download the Fairy Lights mod 1.12.2 version for Minecraft for Mac. It has been suggested to me in one of the comments on one of my previous videos and I have finally decided to do a video uh, showing you how to download it. If you want me to show you how to download any other specific mod or this mod but for another Minecraft version, then tell me in the comments below and I will do a video on that mod or that version in the future as well. But for the moment I'll show you how to download this mod for version 1.12.2 so without further ado let's get into the tutorial. So the first thing you want to do is download Forge 1.12.2 version and to do so uh, go ahead and click on the first link in the description which will lead you to the official Forge website which is completely safe so don't worry about it. Um, and scroll down and download the latest version. Click on installer right here, which is for the Mac version, which is the one we're interested in, which, and this will direct you to another website, so just don't click anything, and it will probably ask you to wait a couple of seconds, and then um, you will be able to skip. So then click skip, and it will start downloading immediately. So just, uh, it doesn't take long. It will warn you that it may harm your computer, but it doesn't, it's safe, so just cl uh, click keep. And then you can uh, drag it to your desktop, right here. You will, found, you will find it in the downloads folder. Next thing you want to do is double click on it, and it will warn you that it's a that it's an unidentified developer so what you want to do is go to system preferences to um, uh, security and privacy and then to open anyway open so you opened it and it will open and make sure that install client is selected click OK And it has successfully installed uh, onto your computer. Now you can go ahead and throw these in the bin. And yeah, you have just downloaded Forge. Now the next thing you want to do is download the actual Fairy Lights mod. So click on the second link in the description, which will lead you to oops, this website and um, just scroll down and find the version that we're interested in which is 1.12.2 and click on download from server 1. If it doesn't work from server 1 then try uh, downloading it from server 2. One of them will for sure work. Then click download, um, close that and it will start downloading and again it will warn you but just click keep and then uh, drag it to your desktop. So once you have downloaded the actual mod then you can go ahead and click on go then go to folder and then copy paste or just write this out in the folder um, in the yeah, folder finder and then click go and it will lead you to the minecraft folder and locate the mods folder and if you don't have one just create a new one and name it mods double click it I already have a few mods from previous videos but just ignore them yours will be empty or not depending on if you have other mods or not and then just drag um, the mod you have just downloaded into this mods folder and yeah the last step is go ahead and click on minecraft I haven't opened it in a while so it's doing this but two hours later Seventy-five years later. 
2,000 years later. So after um, the very, very long um, updating of Minecraft, finally it has loaded and it has updated and I can continue on with this tutorial. So the next thing you want to do is click on this arrow. No, actually the first thing you have to do is create a new um, launch option. Uh, click on add new. Um, and then latest uh, release, I'm gonna, no, I'm just gonna click on, no, I'm gonna click on uh, the forge we have just downloaded, which is this one, 1.12.2. I have more because I had it previously, but this one is the latest one. Click on it and then click, uh, and then uh, let's name it forge 1.12.2. Hopefully I don't already have one. Okay, so this one here. And then click on um, back to news and select the version you have just created, which is Forge 1.12.2. And then click play. And it will uh, load. Okay, once it has loaded, uh, you will see here 8 mods loaded, 8 mods active, and to see what mods you have, click on, you can click on mods, scroll down, and you will see the fairy lights mod right here. You can disable it whenever you want, or you can just take it out of the mods folder, but we're not <laughs> gonna do that now. And then you can, uh, you're good to go to play. So this was it guys. If you found this video in any way useful, then please leave a like and subscribe because it really helps and makes a difference. If you got stuck at any step in this video, then go ahead and leave a comment and I'll try to help you as best as I can. Also, as I previously mentioned, if you want me to show you how to download any other mod or this mod but for another version, then also leave a comment. If you want to check out any of my other Minecraft tutorials, then I'll link some down below or you can go ahead and check them on my channel. Uh, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in future videos. Bye!